Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Skills Talk only on YouTube and in this today's brand new video I'm going to trade on CWRV concept and my today's trading amount will be $30. So let's start this video guys and guys you already know that CWRV concept is the most powerful weapon for binary options trading is a most powerful strategy for binary options trading. So if you uh, have knowledge about CWRV that's great. And if you don't have knowledge about CWRV, you can DM me on my Telegram. Telegram link is in description. And guys, if you are new here on my YouTube channel, please do subscribe my YouTube channel. It will help my channel to grow and also it will help you to grow your trading journey. Because on this particular channel, I used to upload only trading related stuffs like CWRV concept, price action, volume analysis and many more like that. So let's start this video guys. Here I choose AUD JPY for this session for this brand new session and uh, here I'm going to take trades on rejections, some short shots, some patterns. So here as you can see that there is a resistance level here and market is respecting this resistance level and also the volume increased on the rejection of the sellers. So now I will wait for the next candle to touch this level again and give me some rejection from the seller side then I can go with the sellers in full confidence. Otherwise, I will wait for a pattern which is a doji level or spinning top or maybe the pin bar and with low volume then I can go with the sellers. So let's wait for this candle to give me a close and according to the close I will take trades. So let's wait for it and then I will trade and in the meantime you can subscribe my channel if you are new here. So let's wait for this candle it's 20 seconds left. And as you can see guys on uh, the buyer's rejection volume is, is increasing but if the volume decreased you see volume increasing so here I can go with the buyers in full confidence because uh, this is a very good moment this is uh, also a color changing pattern as you already know uh, then uh, like when you see these two candles there will be a red candle and when you see these three candles kind of thing then you will see a green candle it's a color changing pattern and also it uh, it's a very good CWRV rejection and the pressure so according to that I put it $30 here for call option now let's wait for the market to give me a result according to me this will be a green candle and as you can see on your screen that it is a green candle so now let's wait for the closing guys let's see how uh, this candle ends and also if you see the rejection now sellers are trying to enter in the market and trying to push this candle but buyers are strong in this candle that's why this candle is green and this is a buyer's candle so here i won my first trade very first trade so let's move into the next trade so let's uh, choose again the same pair AUD JPY. so here my target is when the candle hit this line then i can go with the sellers if i see any rejection from the seller side then i can trade and i can uh, take a put option so as you can see that uh, sellers entered here entered from here so we can consider that this is a seller's entry point whenever market touch this level sellers come and control the market sellers come and control the market so now let's wait for the uh, candle any type of candle to break this level or to touch this level so these two are the seller zone I mean this is the seller zone so now I will wait for the market to come and come on the seller zone or give me any other uh, signal then I will trade on that so you see on the previous candle the volume was stable uh, but this is a very big red candle but volume is stable so now let's wait for a good confirmation then I will trade so because there is no trade here no strategy here there is strategy but it's 80% and I, I prefer 85 to 90 percent if you rate then I will trade so now as you can see that uh, this is a support zone and uh, also if I copy this line and paste it here then you can see there is a round number here so this we can consider this as a buyer's area and uh, 
Yes, because buyers entered from here and they entered very good. So now I need a confirmation candle. So confirmation candle, how I get the confirmation candle? So whenever I see a green candle on this line, then I can consider that buyers can enter in this market on this place and I can go with the buyers. So let's wait for the uh, candle to give me any rejection. Here the sellers are strong because sellers are trying to push the market. Buyers are weak because buyers didn't push it to the upside. You can clearly see that buyers uh, is not able to push this candle. But here you can see there is a rejection from the buyer side. So here I can take a $30 trade for a call option. Now this candle should respect at least the lower, low, the lower line. Even this is a red candle, it should respect the lower line. So that's why I put it $30 here for call option. Now let's wait for the market to give me a result. According to me, this candle should respect the lower line uh, and this candle can be a, a green candle as you can watch on your screen that this candle is a green candle. Even this was a green, uh, this can be a green can, a red candle, but uh, this will be a winning trade because my entry point is that good. So here I won my second trade of $30. So let's open the same chart AUDJPY. So here as you can see guys that uh, this is a buyer's area. We have the buyer's area and we have the seller's area. So now I will trade when I see any type of rejection or any type of confirm signal then I will trade on that. So here as you can see that uh, buyers trying to push the market up but sellers are strong here again. So here sellers are strong, buyers weak, sellers are strong, sellers are strong, buyers weak still is strong because in this candle uh, this candle first this candle was a green candle then sellers rejected this candle and may uh, and take control over this candle so now let's wait for its vo its volume and the rejection according to me maybe this this uh, level will break out because sellers are continuously sellers are getting strong and strong so let's wait for it guys if, if I find any good setup, any good setup, then I will trade on that. So as you can see that uh, this is a trend line and uh, I need one reversal on this trend line, then I will trade. Otherwise, I will find a good setup, a good accurate setup, then I will trade. You can see sellers trying to push the market down, but here again buyers uh, control over this candle. But uh, here the accuracy is low because market already respected this level. You can see one, two, three candle respected the level and then market move in the upper direction. Here one, two, three candle already respected the lower level. So now let's wait for it that if market goes up like this, like previous or market will break the level. So let's wait for a good confirmation. Then I will trade on that uh, because it's a very good setup. It's a very good and accurate setup. So here as you can see that here three candles, one, two, three, four candles respected this and here uh, respected the lower, lower line and here also there are four candles respected the lower line. Now let's wait for this candle. If this is, will, uh, this is a green candle then I can go with the green. I will go with the call option. Otherwise uh, green candle like this then I will go with the green candle. Otherwise I will wait for the market to give me a great signal. So as you can see that market is trying to go up but uh, there, there are sellers rejection from the upper side. Sellers trying to push the market again and again. But uh, let's wait for it. And uh, here is a retracement setup guys also. This is this candle is not like this candle. So I will avoid here. Now I will wait for the market to break this level. When the market breaks this level then I will trade. So let's wait for it guys. As you can see volume is a stable like the previous one. So here uh, there is no strategy here. So let's wait for a confirm signal then I will trade. You have to just understand the market like this. Like you see in this candle the sellers are strong but the volume was stable and it matched the previous volume, previous VAR volume. So here you cannot say anything about this candle or this is a strategy. So here you can wait for the market to give you a exact setup. So here there is a retracement setup. So now I have to wait for the candle. If this candle close above the level, 
above the upper side resistance level then i can go with the sellers or uh, otherwise i will wait for the market to give me another exact setup or another exact trade here as you can see that uh, this candle didn't break the level it closed below the level i need one sure shot level i need one sure shot candle then i will trade on that you see sellers are trying to push the market down but uh, according to me uh, buyers are trying to also push the market up but uh, the volume is uh, decreasing these two buyers candle the you can see the volume is decreasing so here we can consider that uh, buyers are getting weak and this this level will break very soon so let's wait for a accurate signal if this will be a red candle then my retracement setup strategy will not work here because of this red candle so now i need another confirm signal you can see that this is a red candle so here i have to delete this line this retracement setup line and now my trend line setup will work here because uh, you see this is a very accurate signal trend line setup is a very accurate trend line setup is a very accurate signal accurate setup which will work approx 90% in the real market so let's wait for a reversal on this point then i will trade on that otherwise i will i will wait for the market to give me any exact setup i want two of my trades i explained my both trades and these trades are very good yes so now i am waiting for the third trade so guys if you want to do the same if you want to learn cwrb concept if you want to learn how to read market like this then you can dm me on my telegram there is an offer going on on my courses so if you want to join join right now it's a very good opportunity so yes let's come to the market so here as you can see the volume increased on uh, this pin bar so now i will wait for this candle to show me any weakness or any strength then i will go with that sellers pressure entered there is sellers pressure here so let's wait for this candle guys okay so here i took a call option and uh, let's wait for it guys it's uh, 25 seconds left so i took this trade why because i see uh, there is a rejection there was a rejection from the buyer side you can see there was a rejection from the buyer side and uh, also uh, there is a trend line setup in uh, which i took this trade this setup uh, the, this is not the proper setup this is the half setup and uh, half this setup i trade on the setup and i trade on the rejection also so basically here i traded on two signals there are, there were two signals here one there is a trend line setup i got a reversal from the setup a uh, reversal from here and then i will trade and the second thing is when you uh, backward my video then you will see there was a buyer's rejection from the downside so on that rejection i put 30 dollar here for call option so this is the best way to trade by understanding the market the by understanding the pressure and the sellers and the buyers momentum because when you understand the psychology of the week the cwrb candle week reading with volume then you will be able to understand the market movement and you will be able to trade like this so here i profit my profit today's this session's profit is 75 as you can watch on your screen that i made 75 dollars in three trades and in few minutes that uh, you are watching this video you can you can uh, check the minutes so this is uh, this is it for this video guys and yes if you want to learn this if you want to learn how to read the market how to make profit from the market regularly then you can dm me on my telegram telegram link is in the description Thank you so much guys for watching my YouTube channel and supporting my YouTube channel and that's it for today see you in my next video till then stay safe keep trading bye bye have a greatest day ever guys thank you so much